Hello all and welcome back to another wonderful Ponytown News update video. Today we have ourselves version 0.94.0 and this event here, this update here ladies and gentlemen brings us the Valentine's Day event. It's now officially begun. They added new decorations around the map and uh, also as island placeables. That's right, we now have new Valentine's objects that we can place on our islands and it's quite lovely. So uh, they added a slider for darkening locked, locked outlines. You have to enable that and everything like that. There's a classic dark and light outlines uh, as a value of 50 and 20 on the slider. So you won't have to worry about uh, that being super confusing or anything like that. Now, uh, listing off these changes, there's quite a few here. There's mostly fixes. Well, not mostly fixes, but there's quite a few fixes here and a few changes and improvements. But uh, the main thing that you're all worried about or curious about are those new Valentine's Day objects. We have strawberry baskets, envelope baskets, heart baskets, rose baskets, baskets with the bow, heart envelopes, heart cards, so on and so on. They also added more colors to balloon bundles. So there's now new balloons uh, and everything like that. They had the ability to eat heart letters. That's right. You can eat paper in Pony Town. They finally did it. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Anyway, they added the option to sort friends by account uh, and, and pony name or other things like that. So now there's new sorting options in your friends list, which is really helpful for a lot of people potentially. Ooh, who knows? They added locked outline darkness slider, which I mentioned a minute ago. They expanded the construction site, but it's very, 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 very small. It doesn't seem like they really did anything at all to it. Um, it took me a second to even realize what happened to it, but they did indeed expand the construction site very just a tiny bit they also removed old outline darkness check boxes because they changed that and they changed friends to be sorted by status they changed offline friends to be sorted by last seen improved chat bubble layering and all these other things like that so uh there's those are your changes so i want to first before i get into the game kind of show you this character tab here and kind of show you this little bit of a change that they did with the whole thing so uh it so if you go over to the body tab, it used to be right at the top. And honestly, I really wish it was still at the top. It's kind of weird that it's not like immediately there, or maybe it was never there to begin with. And I'm just completely Mandela affected there or something. But if you allow custom outlines, it, it will bring up this slider or we can remove that and the slider goes away. But if we bring that up, 50 is how it is by default or whatever. Well, maybe not by default, but it's there like that. And we could set it to anything from zero to a hundred and so on and so on. It's kind of neat because rather than having to, you know, click on this and, and it kind of adjust things one at a time or like adjust them to be the perfect color, you can just press this one single thing and it kind of changes all of them. It's pretty nice. It's, it's pretty neat. But uh, that is pretty much it for the changes on this side of things. That's really all they really touched on that but what you're really curious about or what you might really love are the new items there's not really that many new items <laughs> if you're curious of how to get these all you have to do is open up your tab your build menu whatever you want to call it hit the little present there and you can find the new items right there because they're all um valentine's day which is a holiday so it's in the holiday tab as you can see there's there's purple envelopes Ooh, look at that that's pretty lovely and there's heart cards which are basically paper but they also kind of look like those little hardies or whatever like that and so we have all kinds of colors of those like black and in blue and green look at that we have we have a green we have a green heart that's lovely and we can we can we can uh, pick up that green heart just like this and we can eat that green heart <laughs> It's really weird, um, but that is how it is. And of course, if I open up my friends list here in the top right, you can see uh, that there's people online. Ooh, look at that. That's pretty cool. But if I click this settings icon up here, you will see that I can now sort them by status, sort them by their account name, or set them by their character name. This gives you a lot of new options on how you want to sort them. I'm just going to leave it as account name for now because that's how it, it used to be. Uh, it used to use it by account name and now it now it just does something different. It sorts it by status by default now, apparently. But that's a neat little thing there that you can do. So if you're ever struggling with finding your friends or whatever like that, maybe consider you know, messing with this setting and, and sorting them by character name or by status or something instead. Now, by account name or by character name will still be alphabetical. So uh, if you see here, uh, we have underscore and we have a weird symbol and we have numbers and things like that. Obviously, those things are always going to be first, um, but obviously online people are going to be first and then, then it's going to be sorted by that. So no matter how you do it, it will be in alphabetical order. So if I set it by character name, it should be roughly the same. Um, 
for some reason this person is up here first well that's because they have a little symbol in their character name but as you can see if it's a symbol or something it is it goes by first and then it goes in alphabetical order from there on now that is basically it for the update but i want to show you the the new construction side or the progress on the construction side as well as maybe some of the new uh decorations Ooh, look at this there's balloons that's pretty nice <laughs> Honestly, the balloon, uh, the decorations are very sparse, if you ask me. It, like, you could go into a random pot, part of Ponytown and not even realize that the update happened at all. Um, but let's go ahead and... Oh, yeah, also there is a... See, I told them that this wasn't enough. And they, they I guess, didn't didn't believe me. But, yeah, there's, there's supposed to be a, a path of hearts going down from spawn. And if you follow the hearts, you, you'll, you'll get to a point where... Uh, you you find you find a stash you find you find this stash here everyone is covering it up <laughs> I don't know why everyone is covering it up why is there so many people there there's like that's not the only the only thing but anyway here's the the update on the construction progress as you can see you can barely tell that anything actually changed at all all they did is kind of add a couple of new logs here and I don't think this shovel was here previously ooh what's that they're they're shoveling up the snow that's kind of that's that's something I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but of course there's still leaves and everything like that. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the, the for the video. That's pretty much it for the updates. Not really, <laughs> not ex they didn't expect much. I think is what that's. <laughs> People are not happy with the construction at all, and I don't blame them because it's it's so bare bones. It's so weird how bare bones it is compared to the other construction stuff that we got in the past. But anyway, that's going to do it for the video. I hope you enjoyed uh, and I hope it was informative. So if you enjoyed, uh, please do consider liking, subscribing, sharing, and doing all of those wonderful things like that. Because when you do those wonderful things like that, not only do you get access to wonderful content such as this, but you also get to become one for yourself. And I think we all want that. Do those wonderful things and until next time, stay wonderful.